This shit is insane. Check this shit out, y'all. This morning, the FBI is joining the search for potentially dozens of bodies after an Iowa woman came forward claiming her father was a serial killer. We are actively investigating this, and who wouldn't? Authorities are searching an area in Fremont County, Iowa, where a woman, now 53, says as a child she helped her dad, Donald Dean Studi, dispose of up to 70 bodies at the bottom of a well. She claims her father abducted and then killed them over a 30-year period. Most this is crazy. Why is she now coming forward now? I mean, he's been dead since 2013. Hmm. Makes you wonder. Most of the victims, she claims, were female sex workers and transients from Omaha. All we have is a woman came forward and told us a story about bodies and a well. Cadaver dogs have started searching the farmland that used to belong to the family. And though the well no longer exists, authorities say the dogs did react to possible human remains. It's a big mission for a small county. But Fremont County Sheriff Kevin A. Strope is talking about an investigation in western Iowa that is making national headlines. A. Strope says a woman claims her late father killed at least 50 women over a span of three decades and used his children to help bury them in a well in a remote field. The alleged victims are believed to be prostitutes or transients picked up in Omaha and lured to the farm. Now, he says that they looked in it. But then he covers up and says they looked around it. And now she just states that they were buried around the property. But then the lady comes forward and says that they were thrown down the well. And this well is supposed to be 90 feet deep. We will try everything we can to prove or disprove this. But as of this time, we have no nothing. But last Friday, two cadaver dogs did find some. I believe you have more than just nothing. You got somebody coming forward stating that there's bodies somewhere. You bring cadaver dogs in and they hit. Thing, the scent of what is believed to be human remains buried at the exact spot. An old well that was three feet wide and 90 feet deep. The Fremont County Sheriff tells me it took them hours to even find the well, which is in a remote field just over these hills. The sheriff says the well was completely filled in. Astrope says it would cost up to $300,000 to dig the well, so investigators will try other investigative methods first. We will get some different dogs to try it. That'll be one thing. You know, if we do find a site, we could use metal you were already told about the site and you know there's well used to be there and it's now filled in. You have cadaver dogs come out and they hit. So what more do you need to go investigate? Metal detectors to see ground print. What are metal detectors going to do? They don't going they going to detect bones. Penetrating radar, that's a tool we have to, to use. A stroke says since the alleged. Yeah, but I don't think ground penetrating radar goes that far down, but I could be wrong. I'm no expert at anything. Suspect is dead, time is not a factor. There's no urgency that, hey, there's going to be a murder tomorrow. So, so we will move when we can move and do it right. Reporting from Fremont County, Iowa. What are y'all thoughts? This shit is insane.